my poem economy dedicated to peaceful sustainable economy once again is recession bear is begging as the bull disappeared enriching few with profits for investing somewhere else for more money letting institutions beg for bailouts from treasury looting taxpayer savings future of the country making citizens frustrated and panicked shattering dreams of owning home for family as banks rush to foreclose on properties delinquent on mortgage in bad economy millions get laid off without much notice from growing industries stealing hard labors of committed employees now merely burden under expensive new technologies that can work best as slaves without worries it's not far when people used to generate own economy cultivating god given land unspoiled for free harvesting in leisure with family without worries of bullies and their hegemony spending dear resources for military protecting gains that empowered only private monopoly at the cost of citizens communities cities and countries posed by kolke ever wondered why prices of basic commodities rise during recession undermining insulting scholarly economic theory and renowned economists here is the reason at the time of stock exchange drops the fed the federal reserve boss ben bernanke said to his colleagues quote buy everything i shall give you so much money that you will be able to do so you can get as much as you want later when assets get dearer you will make dozens of percents whilst you will give back a mere few percent at around the nominal value we shall declare this program as our joint success unquote feudal capitalist economy needs war related jobs for maintaining apparent prosperity during world war 1 1914 to 1918 thousands of soldiers left for europe from the hudson river new jersey factories made chemicals soldiers trained at fort disk when the great depression hit in 1929 factories closed and many lost their jobs world war 2 1939 to 1945 helped the economy begin to recover factories opened to build airplane engines and warships electronic and chemical industries expanded greatly during this time there is no heaven in the sky earth was heaven when colonialists and their evangelists didn't convert parts of it as hell while motivating the slaves to work harder to reach a fictitious better place heaven equal to heaven end of monarchy and related colonialisms can reestablish lost heaven on earth a place without borders class divisions and supremacist orders god bless our world towards a sustainable natural economy that serves people the best